Hello the internet, welcome back to another um, shifting video here, another healing transformational video, whatever you want to call them. We're going to play around a bit with energies and perception. Um, and today this is a suggestion uh, from someone who contacted um, my web store um, and they talked about, you know, trouble with being seen. And this is something that I can definitely relate to. Um, I have, you know, I always say I've perfected the art of being invisible and now I have to work on the art of being seen. And what a lot of people struggle with this is that they get in their own way with this because to be seen is also to feel vulnerable, to feel exposed, um, and to feel open to, you know, criticism or attack. And for that reason, we often will shut ourselves behind something. So either we aren't seen at all or what, what is seen is not truly us. Um, and, you know, again, this is something that I personally struggle with. Um, and it can be uh, difficult. So we're just going to work with creating some space around ourselves. Um, we don't have to have the whole world looking at us and seeing us and knowing everything about us, but to start to be more comfortable um, with being seen and acknowledged. So, let's take some deep breaths in and out. Ah. <sighs> And I'm feeling a little nervous with this, so that means that this is definitely hitting, uh, you know, a tender spot. I'm going to expand this working space. And move our awareness down into the center of the chest, into the heart. How's it feeling there? You feeling nervous? You feeling a little shaky? That's normal. And what I'm seeing first is sort of like a corridor opening up in front of us, leading into the heart, leading to that space, that soft space, uh, that that both you know wants to be seen and is afraid of being seen. And I'm going to bring in some light from above uh, just to sort of shelter that pathway to illuminate and also to protect. Part of the reason um, we resist being seen or worry about it is uh, the fear of being rejected or of not measuring up. And so I'm actually going to call in some angelic energies to stand behind us um, and, you know, put a hand on each of our shoulders. This is our celestial, you got this kind of support. As I do that, my hands are lighting up. Um, I really feel like the light in them is just wanting to pour out and through the screen. Uh, so I'll allow that to happen. A lot of spiritual practice focuses on, you know, limitlessness. Um, this is particularly um, not that. This is, you know, being seen in our limited form and being just enough. See, being seen as the beauty in that limitation, in that, what you might call, you know, your flaws, um, where you fail to measure up. And 
seeing that as part of the beauty and charm rather than you know what takes away from us so if you can think of it like a crystal ball you know a perfectly clear crystal ball is interesting uh, you know it's novelty but um, it's the one with all the inclusions and different what you'd call flaws that are actually more beautiful and more useful for scrying and seeing with. So allow your heart to be felt, to be seen and to be heard, but from a different perspective, from this perspective of the infinite, uh, loving the finite nature. As I do that, I've, I'm feeling it definitely in the heart, but also in the forehead. And just a radiance kind of coming in through this upper region of the body and torso. <sighs> All right. It's just a little taste of that. Okay, so let's bring the light from above down through the crown of the head down through the body, out through the legs and the soles of the feet into the heart of the earth. And then bring that warmth and love of the earth up, up through your feet, up through your body, up through the top of the head to meet the light as it comes down. All right, thank you so much. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. I hope you liked it. If you want to help support the channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video. If you'd like to support my work, uh, there are links to my website down below where you can book sessions with me or simply leave a PayPal donation. You can also join my Patreon community for extra perks like weekly prayer ceremonies and monthly group healing events. If you can't afford to do that, you can always just show your support by simply liking the video leaving a comment, and sharing it on social media. Until next time, peace and blessings.